It's July the 20th, 2013. This is Wes Fryer, and I'd like to record a screencast to document how I am migrating from a tool called Podcast Generator on a website that I set up back in 2010 to a new website that is in, based on WordPress, and it's using a free plugin called Podlove. Back in December of 2010, I wanted to set up a secondary podcast channel that would allow me to quickly publish audio podcasts a lot faster than I can do on my normal channel. And so I found this tool, and I actually found this in my dissertation research, called Podcast Generator, and it's, it's pretty awesome. It's open source, and it really allows for fast updates. Unfortunately, it... Um, <laughs> I can't figure out how to migrate my stuff well, and there's over 750 megs of stuff, almost three-fourths of a gigabyte. So I did some research and have settled on using a WordPress site, which I'm very familiar with, and then this plugin called Podlove. Now all the documentation for Podlove, as of this recording, is in German, so it's a little challenging, but it's not. Uh, impossible. And I did listen to a great audio podcast interview tonight with the founder that you know gave me a ton of background information about Podlove. And then I actually watched some screencasts in German um, that you know gave me enough of an idea after just kind of exploring the site how to how to get stuff migrated. So I have um, actually created a Google Doc of uh, all of my presentations, and you can see I've I've migrated a few of these tonight already. Uh, and so I'm ready to do these imag this imagination conversation. And so what I'm going to do first is I'm going to just open up this link in a new um, window or new tab. And then I'm going to click the download link. Now, unfortunately, uh, this is broken. And so I've actually had to just temporarily redirect this to a different domain. And then I can change that address and it's going to download. And so while it's downloading, I'm going to copy a few things over into a new episode. And hopefully I can manage to not copy everything there. Ugh. Doesn't look, I don't look very skilled doing this, do I? Here we go. I want to copy that, that title. And I'm going to come here and instead of saying a new post, I'm going to be doing a new episode because Podlove separates uh, this into its own, I think it's called taxonomy. So I'm posting that and I'm going to go ahead and copy the description. And I'm going to paste this two places. It may be duplicative. Well, it is obviously duplicative, but it may not be necessary to do that. I'm going to copy it in those two spots. And now um, I need to go ahead and move my files. So I've been, you can see the, all of these that are marked green, I've, I've migrated. And I'm using the green coloring there and indicating what I've migrated. So that one is now ready to be uploaded. I'm going to click Add Media. And I'm going to upload the file here in WordPress. I did change the default media settings in WordPress so that it's not going to automatically organize by month and year as it you know, typically does with media items because I want everything just to be in a single directory for all of my media files. So that is going to finish uploading. And what I'm going to do now is just copy the title of this. And I'm not going to say insert into post. I'm going to close that window. I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to put this in as the episode media slug. And because that is in the directory where I told um, Podlove this would live, um, then that's going to work. And now I just need to get the duration of my file. And I can see it's 42 minutes and 2 seconds, 42.02. Okay, and the last thing I need to do is get the date. And this was posted on the 24th of January 2011. And so I'll just go ahead and post this, post date this so that this is accurate as to how I how I posted these. And we'll say this is in creativity. Now I'll click publish. So now when I click to view this post, um, we're able to see it. We could go ahead and push the play button here. This is, this is a player that is compatible with iOS devices like iPads and iPhones. And that's the migration process. It's a bit arduous. So I can mark off this one and go on to the next one. I'm probably going to quit for tonight. But if you're interested in learning more, I'd encourage you to Google or check out Podlove Podcast Publisher, and you'll need to install that within WordPress on a self-hosted site. But Podlove looks great, and I'm excited to learn more about how they are seeking to move podcasting forward with chapter marks and other things that aren't currently possible.